Hi, I'm Vicki Jewell with Teledyne Hastings Instruments. Today, we're here to talk about the PowerPod 400 4-channel power supply readout. This instrument is also known as the FIPS 400 and will simultaneously read and control four mass flow controllers at the same time. It is flexible and will also read analog pressure and vacuum transducers. It can supply totalizing functions and do gas blending. Let's start by taking a look at the front panel. As you can see, one of the key benefits of the FIPS 400 is that all four channels can be viewed at the same time. There's no need to surf through channels or turn knobs to see which MFC is reading. Also, the units of measure and process gas can be entered for each individual channel. In this particular instance, we are running three MFCs and a pressure transducer. The pressure transducer is our 760S. The front panel user interface is very intuitive. The channel markings are all along the left hand side and the status of the channels is backlit next to each channel. As you can see, you can also access the key functions valve open, closed, and auto from the top panel. Let's take a look at how this would work. If you'd like to address channel 3, press the channel button. You'll notice that an asterisk appears telling you that this is the channel in play or being addressed. To open the valve, perhaps to purge the line, press open. You can both hear and see the valve response. To close the valve, press the channel button again and press closed. You can both hear and see the valve response. If you were watching closely, you could also see the status change on the backlight. Now let's look at the auto mode. Auto mode works on the FIPS 400 0 to 5 volt signal and allows you to set a set point from the front panel display. Again, simply press the channel button to address the channel and press auto. The versatile design of the FIPS 400 continues on the back panel where you can see that it can be powered by 100 volt, 115 volt, or 230 volt. The power switch toggles on and off and access to the fuses is available from the back panel. Not only do you have the interface for the four channels, but you have the option of RS-232 or RS-485 serial interface, access to alarms, and access to an analog traveler. I hope you enjoyed this content. Please contact us at www.teledyne-hi.com, follow our blog, or reach out on Twitter or Facebook for more information on mass flow control and vacuum measurement.